New details tonight on a deadly stabbing in Palm Desert. Two people are dead, one person seriously injured. It all started with an emergency call about a man with a knife at the Spring Hill Suites by Marriott on Highway 111, right in the heart of Palm Desert. News Channel 3's Bianca Ventura has been on scene there all day. Bianca, what are you learning about this investigation? Hi, John. It's still a very active scene out here, even 10 hours after the stabbing happened in the parking lot right behind me. We now know a man and a woman died from their stab wounds and a third person is hospitalized, but officials have not yet identified them. Sheriff's investigators, a homicide unit and a coroner truck. The investigation into two killings left nearby residents in shock. It's Palm Desert, so usually it's a safe area, but that's alarming. Well, it's usually relatively pretty safe around here. I don't have any problem. I'm, you know, I do a lot of recycling, so I'm out here all night long, you know, two, three, four, five in the morning. One man tells me he's familiar with the hotel where it all happened. He says he would have never suspected a deadly scene to play out like it did here. This hotel, my, my parents come and some of my family comes down. They visit me and they stay here because they have big families and uh, I don't know about that now. Deputies say there was some type of dispute in the Spring Hill Suites parking lot early Friday morning. Sergeant Edward Soto with Riverside County Sheriff's Department tells me one woman and one man died after being stabbed. You can see investigators taking photos of the scene and examining the victim's belongings. Another man was found in the parking lot with stab wounds and taken to a local hospital. I don't know what happened, but I just feel terrible about the whole situation. So Sergeant Soto told me. Sergeant Soto told me that the victim was in critically stable condition last time he checked and investigators are now looking at surveillance video to identify a suspect, but that suspect might even be one of the victims live in Palm Desert. I'm Bianca Ventura. Now back to you at the desk. Okay, thank you, Bianca. Investigators also looking for any witnesses to come forward. If they want to share any information, you can do so without leaving your name or number by calling Valley Crime Stoppers. That number is 760-341-STOP.